My name is Rick Sammons. I'm the director of technology. I've been with Armstrong for about six years. I uh, started out as a developer. Uh, I've kind of been with Armstrong since it was just a two developer shop. Um, and we've grown to 20 people in the IT group now. I, I've always loved my job. I mean, since before I did this job, like when I was a kid, uh, I did horrible in high school. I, I just, I would ace all the tests and not do any of the homework. And so I, I, I was yeah, <laughs> lucky to go through with like C's, you know? Um, but it, the first time I saw a computer, we, we, there was an old magazine called Compute. And my neighbor and I, he had a computer. And I would go over there after school and, and we'd sit and go through Compute. And it seemed like they give you like pages of code and you type it all in and you end up with a little game out of it, you know? And so we'd play these games and this is back when they didn't have floppy disk or, or hard drives really. They, they had memory and then they had a tape drive that you save stuff to. So you'd, you'd have to like rewind the tape all the way, tell the computer what you were looking for and then hit play. And it would go till it found it and then it would read all that into memory and, and do it. So yeah, from day one, the first time I saw a computer, I was just, you know, enthralled with it. And then I. I went from there, joined the Army, kind of lost touch with it for a while, got out, thought I wasn't going to have a career in computers, and a friend of mine started working as a technical recruiter and asked if I knew a couple of certain languages, and I did, and got an entrance into an IT world and have never stopped, you know. I got about 35 jumps, um, all of them military static line. Um, I've jumped from Air Force cargo planes, C-131, and Chinook helicopters. My wife says I jump from hobby to hobby to hobby to hobby, um, which is kind of true from her point of view, but from my point of view, my hobby is just learning stuff. My big thing right now is I started doing woodworking and working on a lathe and making wooden bowls and stuff like that. I just found a charity that supports prevention of trafficking people. And what's cool about it is they take projects like stuff I'm doing and you can donate them and then they'll auction them off and the, the proceeds go to the charity. So that, that's like really neat and, and it's a cool way to get your work out there and see what people think about it. Hopefully not get your feelings hurt, but that's kind of been something I've been interested in and, and I'm trying to get good enough to do a piece that I can give to them and, and see how it does. So all through COVID where other companies have been laying off or, or at least hiring freeze and stuff like that, we've continued to grow. We think we have a great place to work Monday where everybody was there but two people and it was, you know, four people standing up, you know, other people just, you know, scrunched up right next to each other, bringing extra chairs in and stuff like that. So it's, it's growing fast.